On the 4th of July 2024, Labour secured a landslide victory in the general election. However, Britain's global allies and even some Brits still don't know enough about the man who is set to lead the country. So, who is Keir Starmer? Starmer had a blue collar upbringing, with his dad working as a toolmaker and his mum being a nurse. He went to Reigate Grammar School, after which he became the first in his family to go to university. Having studied law at Leeds University and Oxford, Starmer became a barrister in 1987 and practiced human rights law before being appointed chief prosecutor, a role for which he was knighted in 2014. His wife Victoria trained as a lawyer and now works for the NHS. Together they have a teenage son and daughter whom they strive to keep out of the public eye despite his friends describing him as an affable but hyper-competitive soccer fanatic. To the public, Starmer appears dutiful, but perhaps dull and lacking charisma. He entered politics in his 50s and became the MP for Holborn and St Pancras in North London in 2015. He often disagreed with then Labour leader Jeremy Corbyn and participated in a failed plot to overthrow Corbyn, he finally replacing him in April 2020. After the election had severely damaged the party, with morale hitting rock bottom and its spirit broken, Starmer, in his victory speech, vowed to lead Labour into a new era with confidence and hope. He imposed discipline on a party, adopting a zero-tolerance policy on anti-Semitism, which had been allowed to spread under Corbyn, kicking out members, including Corbyn himself. He has now persuaded voters that a Labour government can tackle rising cost of living, ease Britain's chronic housing crisis, repair its creaking health service without increasing taxes. However, the Labour victory is not necessarily a reflection of any real affection for Starmer. Some accuse him of dragging the party from left wing to centre, while others describe him as a grey figure who will do whatever it takes to get into government. I don't think that anybody loves Labour at the moment, former Conservative leader Yane Duncan Smith has said. They're pissed off at the Tories. Thank you so much for that reception. What an amazing reception. We did it! Yeah.